one of my favorite pieces of equipment ever. Whenever someone asks me, what is your favorite piece of equipment? I answer with, I think probably my headphones because when you're making music, you need to hear as many frequencies as possible. You need to hear as much as possible. And if you're recording video, you actually need to put in your headphones and listen to the microphone inputs. So wherever I go, I will take my headphones. But now I present to you my Audio-Technica ATH M50X, which I might have broken yesterday. I put them on my head and I heard that one side wasn't working anymore. That was really heartbreaking. So I immediately went online and I bought a new pair of headphones. Well, the same ones, the ATH M50X, because I love these headphones. I remember four years ago when I bought these headphones when I was in high school, it felt like an investment really. When I got the package and I was opening it up, I was so excited, but let's open it up. So let's take it out of the plastic bag. Audio-Technica. So another logo. Another logo. There you go. All right, so in here we have the manuals and the carrying pouch, which I absolutely love. It's just nice quality, it feels rich. All right, so here are the, uh, the headphones itself. Let's take that off. I've been using my headphones so many years, so now it feels so fresh. Even the original ear pads that I haven't felt for so long because they totally wear off. These feel so good. And on top we have the logo as well. They're expandable. Yeah, it looks just really nice. A different material on there. And the input for different cables. <laughs> That's funny. You have all the cables. The short original cable. All right, so this cable goes in here like this. You get it in and then turn it a little and it's locked. Then we have a second cable. Oh, this one is just the longer version of the first one. That is the packaging. All right, so in conclusion, I think they absolutely are really comfortable on the head. I think they look good as well. They're a little bit bulky, but what can you get with over-ear uh, headphones, right? So why do I love these headphones? Well, first of all, for the sound. It has a really unique sound. Of course, these headphones are not completely flat. They are a little bit strong on the bass and on the high end. Uh, people have been saying it's an M shape, so here you can see uh, what it actually looks like, so what the spectrum really looks like. I like the fact that they are um, noise cancelling as well. It's not an active noise cancelling, it's a passive one, so you kind of hear muffling around you when you put them on. I hear my sound less than normally, so when you put them on, it's sound isolated but not fully, so don't expect too much of it, but it absolutely helps when you're trying to focus on what you're doing with these headphones. You will notice them a lot in music production videos or producing uh, producers having them, and producing with these headphones. So that is something really nice. I always say, hey, that, those headphones, I have them too, and they're really nice, I really like them. So I also like the versatility of the different cables that come with these headphones. Four years ago, when I bought my first pair of headphones of these ones, I got three different cables with it as well, and they aren't damaged at all, and I brought them everywhere. So um, I mean, now I got six cables, and I'm really happy with it, because I can just put them everywhere and listen in a different way. So if you're, for example, making music, and you need the full, uh, 
uh, jack size, you can screw them off one and put them on the other. So these are the three different cables. Boy, this is a mess. This is the first regular cable. It's 1.2 meters and it's just for casual listening. It's short, it doesn't get in the way. So that is really nice for that. Uh, one downside though, you can't screw uh, the full jack size on there. There's only a possibility for uh, the 3.5 millimeter jack on there. So, and the second cable is a three meter straight cable. And on this one, you can actually uh, screw the full size jack. Last but not least, we got the coiled cable. It's a, a 1.2 meter when it's like this, and if you scratch it all the way, you get three meters out of that, which is cool. And you also get like the, the full size jack on there. And also if you screw that off, you got the 3.5 regular mini jack. If you come home and you've been straight listening to something on your phone, and you just you can just keep your headphones on and switch cables like that. These headphones have been serving me really well and I really like it. And I want to thank you for watching and I hope to see you in the next video. Well, that was sudden, wasn't it? Anyways, thank you for watching and see you in the next one.